on a pleasant good Wednesday morning. It's the 26th day of April 2023. It is overcast again today. It's going to be slightly warmer today with highs in the mid to, in the mid 70s today, upper 70s tomorrow and Friday. But the weekend as we say goodbye to April, it's going to be in the 80s in most areas and valleys near 90. And then a trough of low pressure is going to dig down to Southern California coast and across the state bringing in May gray and cooler conditions. So yeah, it's gonna feel like summer and then back to winter almost. I mean, this bipolar weather pattern has been, it, it's been weird, but it was only 71 yesterday and Monday. So, but the valleys and the deserts are gonna heat up though. They're saying by tomorrow and Friday, it's gonna be well over a hundred in Palm Springs. And um, also um, the Dodgers with a big win yesterday with Chris Taylor's home run in the eighth inning that gave us a lead for good. And the Angels, of course, as well won. And, and yes, tonight is a big night for the LA Lakers as they try to wrap up the series and take, take care of business and beat Memphis and advance to the second round. And also there's a big game in Sacramento between the Kings and the Warriors, game five. The home team has won every game of that series so far. But since the Kings are back home, I have a good feeling they're gonna win tonight. And Cleveland and Milwaukee are gonna try to stave off elimination in game five as well. So game fives are huge. Of course, we already know that the Suns and the Nuggets took care of business last night. And the Hawks, of course, are still alive. Also, happy birthdays going out to Aaron Judge, um, Jet Lee, um, Mike Scott, and to uh, Joe Creedy and to Jeff Blum. And yes, it is still overcast right now, but it is going to be mostly sunny by the afternoon. And yes, hopefully the Dodgers take get another win in Pittsburgh this afternoon as well. And let's hope the Cardinals get a win against the hated Giants up north. And yes, the Miami Heat and the Los Angeles Lakers are attempting to become the first teams in the play-in era to advance in the second round as well as a seven seed or lower. Um, so yes, go Lakers and go Dodgers, go Kings and go Cardinals. And I hope the Knicks wrap it up too tonight. And I hope that the Heat also wrap it up as well. And also, Sacramento, light the beam tonight. Amen.